Last week, Terrell County's win over Mitchell County marked the first time since 1986 the Green Wave defeated the Eagle. And to give some perspective on how long ago that was, I wasn't even born. And it's just one of the reasons Terrell County is our Fox 31 Sports Team of the Week. The Green Wave now hold fate in their hands in Region 1 Single A. Entering tonight, they had just two games left in the regular season. Against the first against Randolph Clay and the last against Miller County. If they win the region, it'll be the first time since 1950. And let's try not to get too ahead of ourselves. 16 to 6 in the first quarter, Randolph Clay and the Red Devils are adding on. Give it to, to Corey Coleman. He punches it in from the two yard line. Two point conversion, no good. 22 to 6, Randolph Clay. On the kickoff, Randolph Clay sending a message to Terrell County. Fred Wilburn delivers a huge hit. But the Green Wave would recover the fumble and move the ball down the field. So later in that drive, it will be Joseph Minter. He takes the handoff and gets Terrell County within five yards of the end zone, sets them up with a first and goal, and that leads to Austin Johnson punching it in for the touchdown. 22 to 12 Randolph play, and Terrell is going for two. The Trevion Bishop fakes the pitch and rushes it in. 22 to 14 at that point, but the final score is 55 to 28. Randolph play with a win.